Buenos días, campeones. Buenos días, campeones. Buenos días, campeones. Welcome to our show. Oh, buenos días, campeones. Buenos días, campeones. Buenos días, campeones. Welcome to our show. <laughs> buenos días, campeones. Buenos días. Thank you, Mr. Wellman, for tossing in that percussion accompaniment there. It was my pleasure. <laughs> welcome, welcome. It's good to be here. <laughs> how, are you, how are you doing? I'm doing all right, you know, just uh, trying to stay in a little bit of a, a routine, a little bit of a schedule to, you know, keep some sort of normalcy going. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You've been making uh, any music at all? Um, yeah, we have been. So um, Eric and I have both had a couple of uh, projects that we've been working on. Um, as soon as the quarantine started, we did a virtual marimba quartet that uh, a friend of ours, Matt Moore, composed. So we, uh, we, we learned that and we videoed it and sent it in. And uh, they're currently in the, the final stages of, of putting it all together. So hopefully we'll be able to see it soon. Uh, and then a, uh, another friend of ours, um, Maverick, did an um, electronic um, soundtrack that everybody's supposed to just come up with their own music over the top of it. And then he's going to take all the videos and sort of put them together. But it's just everybody composing their own thing over the top of his uh, soundtrack. So that's, that's the one that I'm working on right now. I just started that one yesterday. Oh, yeah. That's... So the we let's talk just for a second about the marimba one, mm -hmm. uh, and how many people entered into that? Was it like? It was a lot. Yeah, it was. Um, I want to say it was like a, a couple or three hundred that that entered. It was a uh, it was a lot of entries. Yeah. So from uh, several different countries, and uh, yeah, it should be really really cool when it comes out. I'm I'm looking forward to seeing it. And they're just gonna edit all of that together into like. Like everybody that's entered is going to be a part of that. Yeah. So the the quartet is obviously written into to four parts, and so each of us were assigned a part uh, based on our birth month, <laughs> and so um, so I, I had part four uh, or part three. I can't even remember right now. But anyway, so whatever your birth month was, that that's the part that you played, and then they'll put the videos together based on the part, and then and then put them all together. Um, in a lot of different video screens and i'm sure there'll be some uh alternating of folks in there there has to be with that many people involved yeah that sounds awesome would you uh would you mind to show us a little bit of the uh, what you're working on currently yeah so the uh the uh soundtrack that the guy wrote uh he wanted everybody to play it on a, a drum practice pad uh, percussionists spend a lot of time practicing on practice pads when we're indoors because it's not so loud. So um, this is uh, my practice pad right here. It's actually a custom practice pad that uh, some students of mine got me several years ago. This oh, nice. is uh, back when I lived in Texas. So that's a picture of them uh, playing the bass drums right there. So that was a, a fantastic bass drum line. So. Um, so basically, I listen to the soundtrack and I just come up with stuff over the top of it. And so right now, I just started working on it yesterday. I've got some just real basic uh, ideas, basically a sketch. And so um, hopefully the microphone will pick this up. This is a little bit of it, just a, just a few measures. Okay. So. Adjust this down right now. Yeah, yeah. Everybody see that? Yep. Mm -hmm. So basically... <laughs> so that's that's what the whole thing is going to be based on so it'll it'll uh come back to that occasionally go away from it use ideas from it uh all through the soundtrack that's awesome that's cool i like that uh i like that it's called a sketch too i like that like you know as a visual arts guy that yeah. i resonate with that that's cool yeah well cool cool man 
I've also look, been playing a, a lot of uh, NBA 2K20. <laughs> so uh, my uh, my uh, my player just made the All Star game. I'm pretty proud of him, and uh, we hope to do well in the three point contest. <laughs> Have you seen any of the, the videos of the guys? Uh, like I saw one yesterday. It was like a father and his two sons. And they, they were playing a track from like a, a professional basketball game while they were like reenacting it in their kitchen. Like Oh, oh no. <laughs> I haven't seen that. No. <laughs> it was awesome. <laughs> yeah. Cool. All right. All right, friends. Anybody have a ukulele hat nearby? I just happen to have one. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Representing the drums. That's All right. right. Here we go. I know a place where I can be great. And feel the better me. Every single day at Invest Collegiate, we imagine, we nurture, we value, we engage, sustain, and transform as we stand in opportunities in leadership and learning. Greatness, inspiring achievements all within a telescopic environment. Invest collegiate imagine. All right. All right, Mr. Wellman. We have prepared a game for you, sir. I'm so uh, excited. <laughs> <laughs> So we are going to play a game we like to call this, that, or the other, uh, in which we give you three categories. So uh, we chose these categories based on what we know about you. So first, first group is percussionists. So uh, we're going to give you a list of people. Some of them will be percussionists. Okay. The second group is golfers that have won the Masters. Nice. Yep. You enjoy golf. I yeah. saw the poster over your shoulder there. Oh, yeah. US yeah. <laughs> and the third group is uh, rappers real names. Got it. <laughs> uh, so, I don't know. Maybe you're way more into hip-hop than uh, I think you are. but um, that was Especially, kind of especially in the 90s, for sure. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, so uh, yeah, we're going to read off a list of people. And you just tell us whether you think they are a percussionist, a master's winning golfer, or if it's a rapper's real name. Got it. Okay. All right. Here we go. First one, Ralph Gouldall. I'm sorry, you're, you're breaking up. Can you say that again, please? <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 for sure. Ralph Gouldall. Uh, I'm going to say... Oh, just so you know, also, you've got uh, two lifelines, uh -huh. and the lifelines are uh, myself or Mr. Higgins. Okay. We'll step out of the room, and we'll shout an answer to you uh, from, the, <laughs> from the other room next door. So. Okay, got you. Okay, so, uh, so Ralph Goodall, is that what you said? Yes. I'm going to go with rapper's real name. No, I'm sorry. Ralph Gouldall won the Masters in 1939 uh, uh, yeah. at the time with a record-setting score of nine strokes under par, um, which stood for several years, many years. This is a really – I think this is going to be a tricky game, just so you know. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. <laughs> <laughs> so, so make sure you use those, uh, those lifelines there. Yeah, I got it. Uh, I do feel like also, I think, I think, I could be wrong, but I think you're going to know the percussionist, but I don't, I don't, I don't know percussionist personally, but I was like, oh, I feel like. <laughs> let's, let's hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Barton, do you have the list as well, or am I, am I rolling on? I do have it. Okay, you want to take the next one? I will. All right, second, number two here. Uh, so, rapper golfer or percussionist Christopher Wallace Christopher Wallace uh, I'm gonna go with a lifeline oh lifeline you okay want... Higgins are you gonna take this one I, I can take this one yeah all right <laughs> 
It's a rapper. <laughs> um, I'm going to go with a uh, rapper. Oh, yeah. got it. <laughs> yes, Christopher Wallace uh, was known to the world as Notorious B.I.G. Uh, I thought that was right. I was just, I just second my, guessed myself after the first failure. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely done. All, All right. right. Uh, number three, Evelyn Glenny. That is a percussionist. Oh! Boo, 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 boo. Yes. I she's, had a also, uh, she's also deaf, little known fact. Oh, really? Yeah. I know that piece. Yeah, she plays, she plays entirely uh, barefoot so that she can feel vibrations through her feet. Oh, wow. That's amazing. I saw she, she's a Scottish, the, the little bit of research that we